Hi everyone, this is Andy with Bloomberg.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to transfer information from your CRM to a Pandoc template using tokens. Let's start. All right, I am already in my Pandadoc account. And the first thing we have to do is check out that our CRM integrates with Pandadoc. To do that, click here on the left bottom corner in settings, and then go to integrations. This is a list of all the apps that integrate with Pandadoc. And as you can see, the majority of them are CRM software. Some of them have a direct integration like this one right here. And you can tell that because of this toggle, you could turn it on and off for other apps like this one, you have to click on learn more and follow the steps there. And some apps have a Chrome extension set up. So just click here and install the extension and then you will be able to use tokens. In my case, I use Soho CRM that already has a native integration and I have it on right here. And before we start, I also want to show you another website. This is the Panadoc Community Help Center website. And if you go to integrations and then CRMs, you're gonna be able to find this list where you can open any of these articles that is gonna tell you how to set up the integration. And now I'm gonna go back to Panadoc and I'm gonna open the templates page. I already created this template where I'm gonna be adding some tokens. So this is a proposal and we have these three fields up here that we want to autocomplete every time we create a new document using this template. There are two types of tokens, the ones that are predefined in Pandadoc and tokens that are created in your CRM. For this example, we're gonna use both. Let's start with the easiest one. We have this dated here and we wanna insert the date that the document was created on. So just click on it. And then here on the right, we're gonna go back and we're gonna click on tokens. And then down here, we have some predefined tokens. So we're gonna click on this one and that token was copied. And then we're gonna go back here and paste it. And you can see that that's a token because it's highlighted in yellow. All right, now we're gonna grab some tokens from the CRM. So I'm gonna open my Soho CRM account and I already have a deal open here. And the next step is gonna be slightly different for each CRM, but for Soho CRM, you just have to click here where it says show Panadoc tokens. And this new page is gonna show all the tokens that are available. So the next token we wanna add is the deal name. We wanna transfer the deal name from CRM to the template. So we're gonna click here where it says deal. And then you can use the search bar to find it, or you can scroll down until you find the token. In this case, it's this one right here, and it's called potential name. So I'm gonna copy this one and go back to the template, and we're gonna add it here. So we're gonna replace this text with a token. And again, Pandadoc knows that that's a token, so it highlights it. CD is also a token that we're gonna grab from the CRM. So I'll go back to the page that we just opened. We're gonna scroll all the way up, and we're gonna search for it. So this is the token right here. I'm gonna copy it. Go back to the template and paste it right here. And finally, below we have the signature area where we're gonna add a customer name right here where it says customer. So we just need the customer name. I'm gonna go back here, remove the search. In this case, you have two ways to find it. You can do it in the deal tab or in the contact tab but we're gonna use the deal. So click here, and then we're gonna find a token that represents a customer name. So I see it right here, contact name. So I'm gonna copy it and go back to the template and we're gonna paste it right here. All right, so the template is completed and we're gonna test it out right now. So I'm gonna go back to the CRM and that's where I generate the documents from. So we have this button here that says show Panadoc tokens but if you click here, it says send with Panadoc. And now we're gonna pick the template that we just updated. We're gonna select the client and start editing. And as you can see, all the tokens are filled out. This is a Panadoc token. And this one, this one, and the customer name are CRM tokens. Now you can edit the document as much as you need and then send it. All right, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and please let me know in the comments below if you have any questions. 
I also have other videos about Pandadoc on this channel, so feel free to check them out. Thanks for watching.